All right, everybody, we are back here with another demo. We've got Kevin Van Ord, the illustrious, world-renowned man about the Internet. Kevin Van Ord, who's that's, here. That's me, all right. Man about the Internet. I, that didn't make any sense. Uh, we've got Kevin here to show us a little game for the PC entertainment system called Jamestown. Or the, the PES, as I prefer <laughs> to call the, it. The PES. Um, well, here's, here's an interesting fun fact before we begin. So this, this, this game is called Jamestown, right? Okay. Well, I grew up in a town called Warren, PA. Okay. It, it actually, people actually say Warren, PA, Pennsylvania. So Warren, that's actually, PA. it's Warren, PA, <laughs> Pennsylvania. Okay. So I grew up in this town called Warren, not half an hour from Jamestown. Not, okay. Which is itself not to be confused with Jonestown. Which is a place where a, a bad thing happened. Yeah, involving like Kool-Aid Kool -Aid of some variety. Oh, yeah. yeah. And uh, Or, not to be confused <laughs> they with... They did not do that when they all died. <laughs> with I don't think they said anything because they were dead. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but not to also be confused with Jamestown, um, New York, which is what I'm talking about. But this, okay. the, game, the game is Jamestown, <laughs> Virginia, right? People are starting to so. doubt whether we actually have a game to show. I no. can confirm... Here, a world exclusive confirmation that we are just not talking out of our butts. That we actually have yeah. the game to show. So, so this is actually this this looks kind of colonial when okay. you first look at it. But actually, this is more of a a steampunk version of Jamestown, a near future. And you're not just saying um, that because you downloaded it on Steam. Correct. Let's um, guys, can we get all right? There we go. So let's let's let's. We're just gonna go ahead and jump into this. This is a shmup. You've heard oh. of a shmup, correct? Uh, yep. That's, that's short for shoot 'em up. Yeah, that is true. It's very short for shoot 'em up. So I have my special friends, and I'm player four because they all beat me to it. My special friends, Curtis Side, Tom Mache, and, and Carolyn Pettit, are over right. on the side. And they're going to help me out in four player co op. And there are four different ships here in this shmup. I'll take the beam ship because everybody else wants something fancy. The beam ship is what you start the game with. Nice. But they, they decided that I was. So. This is, it's interesting because most shmups don't even try to, to weave any kind of story in what they do. Um, this, this one's different. And so, <laughs> as you know from a shmup, we shoot things. Yep, um, hence the shit part of shmup. Exactly. But there are things to, <laughs> but, <laughs> but it is worth pointing out that when we kill things, um, these medallions drop down. We want to pick those up. We did, we wow. did great. And the reason... You know, you don't have to pick diff like high level difficulties. You can play on easy, that's fine. I'm not gonna no, judge no, no. you. No, 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 I'm not gonna play on easy. Now, I've, I, this is the first time I'm playing this co-op. I've played only on my own so far. Okay. These jokers are getting in my way. What um, a bunch of jokers. So so do you go for the pink donuts or do you avoid those? You you go, you avoid the, the pink ones. Okay. Um, those are bad things. Bad you pick donuts. up the gold ones. Okay. Go, who, who is it that's playing? That's Curtis. He's our game guys editor, so it only goes to to show you that they're they're actually good at what they do. They they know how to play games. He's the me. only one in this office who's good at video games. <laughs> so we're we're kind of proving what's 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 going on here is that we're all bad except for Curtis. Um, but now this is see we can't hear this, but this is actually this moody part where uh, where, uh, where where oh geez, it's where we're kind of setting the setting the atmosphere here. The music is actually really great in this game. Um, I, I really, really appreciate the music for its kind of sci-fi colonial combo. Okay, so... Ah! I can't see what's going on. I can, <laughs> I, I can see what's going on. I have literally, literally no idea what is going on. Though. Now, we can activate, once we pick up enough of those gold things, okay. um, we can activate what's called Vaunt. Um, and what that does is it allows us to do more, uh, more damage. All right. While we're in that mode, although if somebody activate Vaunt so they can show us, so we can show that off. There we go. So now we've got that going on. Now they take uh, they take less damage. They do more damage. They get more points for what they're doing. And that is what it is all about: is killing. So okay, did you did we talk at the beginning about the setting of this game? That Wait. it's a colonial era game is, set on Mars. Is this it? is a colonial era game set. Um, elsewhere, Mar okay, it on is Mars. Mars on Mars, which is I, I'm, when they I'm really started. Over Caro, who's like, played more of the game than I have. Yeah. So, oh, so the Martians are affiliated with Spain, oh. which just goes to show you that Spain Spaniards aren't always taking siestas. Sometimes they attack. 
Now, as we all know, the uh, the 1600s is when NASA was formed and when they yes. set about on their first that's, space that's voyage. That's common knowledge. Um, we, I mean, you can look at that up on Wikipedia. That's just common knowledge. Science fact. That's a science fact. <laughs> Uh, so this this is the kind of game where it's difficult to talk and play at the same time. Right, but we're gonna make it. This is difficult anyways. to play. No, I mean I do not play shoot 'em ups because they are so difficult. Uh, I'm kind of a baby when it comes to difficulty in games. Well, one thing I'm noticing is that things like you get more in single player, you don't die as quickly. Um, I'm definitely dying with with a few shots, unlike in single player. Okay, so this this is, um, I don't know what this is. Somebody help me out. I, what, this is a big one-eyed monster. It's That's, an alien. Yes. Oh, it's well. It's thank you, boss. thank you. It's a boss. It's the lady of the lake. It's it's the the lady lake. Of the lake. Am I gonna pull out Excalibur if I? Oh wait, that's that's a different country. I got the R. There's so much shmupping going There's on. There's a lot right of there. shmupping going on. Now this is, is, is this taking place in Roanoke? I wanna say that this is taking place in Roanoke. There's a lot of talk about like historical figures like John Smith uh -huh. and, and, and folks like that, um, which which is, again, it's, it's, it's really fascinating to, to watch these kind of play out, these, these little cutscenes and, and story elements. Um, so Obviously, we don't know to avoid the big beam coming out of its eye. Kevin, we have a number of audience questions I coming in here. I bet you people are curious about we have this, this literally, game. We have literally tens of audience questions at the moment. Shoot uh, one of them if is they're from... about my shirt, that's perfectly fine. If they want to know more about Ooh. Jamestown, New York, which is where Lucille Ball is from, and yes. 10,000 Maniacs, shoot. All right. Lim AK wonders how much harder is it playing co-op versus playing it alone it's harder it is harder so yeah. they scale up the difficulty then as far as i can tell they're they're scaling up the difficulty i'm dying much quicker just with a shot right um than i did in single player and i'm playing on this because i'm playing on hard and i chose hard just now when we were playing oh, um sad so yeah so here you got some information on uh on uh, this this woman in the woods. This woman? Yeah, I'm, I'm so glad I can shed light on this game. I, I think I think that we have done a spectacular job of informing people what Jamestown is all about, and uh, just you know generally being professionals and good at uh, explaining video games. Well, it, it's funny because Maxwell McGee is actually the one that's 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 playing this game oh, up okay. close and personal. Oh, okay. I only took a little bit of time with it. All right. So and, uh, so yeah, that's that's why I sound kind of nutty. All right, excellent. So this game is it already available on Steam. It is already available on Steam on okay. the PC Entertainment it's System. It's available on on the Steam Entertainment System. Uh, that you can go, you guys can go out and download this game right now if you want.